What is going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys enjoy that leg day. It was actually pretty cool to, uh, you know, be more out of my comfort zone and actually talk amongst you guys uh, in an open area. You know, I, I think a lot of the times people underestimate vlogging because I think nowadays everybody wants to be a vlogger, but I don't think a lot of people have what it actually takes to become one. And what I mean by that is that it, it's kind of nerve wracking to really just you know do this in front of a camera in front of 30 40 people in a not really in a close space but you know kind of just around you just looking at you talking to the camera they probably think you're a weirdo um and a lot of times you might be but it, it, it's, it's hard it's hard uh today i'm gonna go ahead and hit a shoulders and tricep workouts i'm gonna try to get as much footage as you can as much footage as i can to show you guys uh, my routine Nothing really has changed. I'm kind of a, in a regiment of a workout plan, but I'm, you know, I'm kind of, my goal for each time is kind of to start increasing the weight while keeping the intensity the same, if not more. I realized the way I'm working out is, I'm, my body responds a lot more with drop sets um, than supersets. Now, if you guys don't know the difference between a superset and a drop set, uh, basically, you know, when you're supersetting an exercise, you know, you're going from one exercise to doing another uh, without, a, without a rest. That, that way it helps exhaust the muscle a lot more. But I think for me, the best way to do it is to do a drop set. Now, what I mean with a drop set is basically, you know, you do one, you would do one set, you know, between 10 to 12, and then you do a drop set with, you know, decreasing the weight just slightly and then doing 10 to 12 again. But usually what I do is I do two drop sets after my last working set, which really tires me out uh, in the long run. I can really feel it efficiently. And I think that's what's gonna keep the intensity of my workouts going. Um, and it's probably gonna be a lot more proficient for me to build muscle that way. Uh, just because I do have a hard time with muscle endurance, not muscle strength, it's, it's weird. You know, you have a lot of these big guys uh, repping between, you know, 405 to five plates, um, et cetera, et cetera. But you will never catch any of these guys ever doing any kind of high rep momentum. It's, it's, it's just how it is. But, you know, personally as a bodybuilder or at least an amateur bodybuilder, that's how I want to train. I believe, you know, it's called bodybuilding for a reason. Um, you know, I'm not here for, you know, strength gains. I'm not here for, uh, weightlifting. I'm not here for a powerlifting meet. I'm here to basically build a physique of my own, um, taking step by step uh, into weight. You know that can help me actually proficiently uh, build muscle where I'm lacking. You know, uh, I mean, don't underestimate the fact that you know it's pretty cool benching. You know, 315 and squatting four plates, five plates, six plates, and things like that. You know, it's 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 crazy. Um, but you know, hopefully, you know, one day I'll get there. I'm just, I'm in no rush. I'm trying to take my time and really just, uh, really let my body, act, you know, do the momentum in the right way. What's going on guys? Welcome back to my first voiceover in my channel. I hope you guys enjoy and I definitely hope I don't mess this up. But if you guys have stuck around this so far, um, I want to go over my approach on what's to come moving forward. Now, I know a lot of you guys, and I've even explained it myself, what I've been doing, how much I've been eating, and things like that in my last video. And, you know, what the plan will be, you know, with all of that work. And basically, you know, I want to recap on what I've been doing is just, you know, eating as much as I can, lifting as much as I can, sticking to my plans, my, you know, my training plan, my diet plan, you know, taking my supplements day by day, you know, drinking water on water on water every day. Um, just trying to get the most out of this bulk because on May 4th, I will be starting a prep for my first Men's Physique show on August 10th. I can't tell you guys how excited I am to really announce this to you guys because it is something that I have not always wanted to do. However, you know, looking past these past three years, you know, people on stage and all these crazy physiques. Um, on stage and people, you know, competing. I've, you know, I've had that itch in me to try it out and get my feet wet. Now, with that being said, guys, 
I'm going to do everything that I can to take advantage of this last couple of weeks I have left on this bulk to really, really put on some serious size before I start prep because that's where I'm going to show you guys what I've been building underneath this little fluff, <laughs> if you guys want to call that, or I guess a little layer of fat um, on here. You know, I've been pushing myself every single day, motivating myself, you know, prepping my meals. I've been sticking to it as much as I can because I really, 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 um, and I don't, you know, I don't want to expect to be first place in my first show, but I don't want to let myself down thinking, you know, I could have put on a lot more if I worked a lot harder. And by putting on a lot more, I mean I put on a lot more muscle. But yeah, guys, you know, I'm excited because this is going to mean a lot more videos for you guys to see. And if any of you guys are curious that you guys watch my YouTube videos, um, you know, how a prep goes about, you know, the changes in my body, the changes in my physique, the changes um, in my meals, the changes in my training, you know, my cardio is going to change. It's going to, I'm going to implement a lot more cardio for sure. Um, things like that, that I'm not even familiar with, which yeah, I'm, it's the reason why I'm so excited to show you guys because I think this is an opportunity to really show the people who are watching, you know, how you can push yourself to change, um, change the way you look and feel a lot more comfortable and just no matter what you're doing for a competition for, you know, it's just a day in the life of just being yourself, you know, whatever the case might be, guys. I want to make sure I can be there to motivate whoever is watching. Um, so with that being said, guys, make sure you guys leave a big thumbs up on this video. If you guys did enjoy it, let me know in the comments below. I'll be happy to do another one. Till next time, guys. Peace.